Gary Wilmings here in Munich, Germany, getting ready for a week of sightseeing with Grey Line, and I cannot wait. And with me is Franny, the lead tour guide. I love the variety of tours that you guys offer. What's the most popular? The most popular one is the Royal Castle Tour, where we take all the visitors to Neuschwanstein Castle, the famous castle, which was made popular by Walt Disney. And there's also a tiny treasure included in that tour as well. Tell us about that. Linnerhof Castle. Yeah. It's only one third of Neuschwanstein, but the inside is just amazing. A day of castles on that one. Another one that I really enjoyed still has the castle thread, but it's a medieval tie this time. The romantic road tour. I also absolutely loved this one to see yeah. the medieval castle, and I could have spent the entire day in the village. Tell us about this experience. Yeah, we go to Harburg first, which is a medieval castle built more than 800 years ago, and uh, it's located on a mountain and it's really really fancy and the village of course I'm sure you guys hear the best reviews from people after spending some time here yeah they really like it because there you see Germany how it was like 500 years ago right because the first buildings there were built in about 900 so these are buildings that actually escaped destruction after the war where in Munich most of the city was destroyed That's so true. it was great that you guys offer a tour like that to see really what Germany was like and really maintains the history yeah it's a long ride but worth it I know that there's also half day tours. Um, we did, of course, get a great tour of Dachau from you. Um, of course, this is a more solemn tour, but still very important. Tell us about this site. Yeah, it is quite sobering, but of course, National Socialism is part of our society and a part of our past. And we have to yeah, take people there, inform them about everything. And this is a former concentration camp um, for people who don't know. And so you see the old barracks there. Um, definitely, um, it's, a, it's a lot, you can feel a heaviness while you're there, but of course it's a place I think very important to visit. Yeah. So history doesn't repeat itself and you guys offer that opportunity. There's just so many great reasons to travel with Greyline. You guys have been so organized and efficient and I'm sure that for people that are traveling in groups it offers some added security and there's just a lot of ease that comes with it. And the buses are so comfortable. The luxury bus, tell yeah. us about that. Oh, it's a great bus with single seats, reclining seats, service on board. It's just gorgeous. Wi-Fi, coffees coming to you, a snack box, and even the one that isn't the luxury that we took on the romantic road tour. It's still very comfortable, a double-decker. We might not have been able to recline, but it was still a very peaceful ride to see yeah. a lot of the countryside. And it's very important we have bathrooms on board. <laughs> that is very important. So when you are visiting Munich, Germany or any major city that Grey Line does have tours, it's a great way to really see a lot of history with great guides who give you a lot of history along the way so that you have a foundation going in to enjoy the experience even more. I've had the best week. Thank you so much for everything.